Hello. Good to see you again. Today, we're going to do some wild camping. 48 hours on the top of a Munro. Two Munros actually. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna try to shoot this at sunrise. This beautiful loch with the pop of Glanco. And uh, I hope for some moody weather, like really moody weather. And uh, it's gonna be glorious, or at least I hope it's gonna be glorious. But yeah, two Munros, 48 hours. I hope the camera will last enough to record this. 48 hours with the midges and it's gonna be, yeah, I think it's gonna be spectacular. There's already some spectacular light now, but I'm not taking a photograph now because I need to go higher up, set a tent and eat and then wake up for the morning sunrise. Although the light looks beautiful. I'm ready to go. I hope you're ready. And we're going to the top of the Munros. Let's go. <laughs> Found a campsite I'm gonna stay in overnight. Um, behind me is like a beautiful sunset happening now. It's like beautiful golden light just streaming down the, the loch. I might take a panorama just for a memory here, but that's not gonna be on the vlog, that's just for me. <laughs> I know people wanna see the photo as well in the end. Uh, that way it's literally in cloud now. There's rain coming towards me and it's gonna pour down in a minute. Something just happened. I just lost my tent. I really can't believe it like oh Wow, and it is far down. It's probably 100 200 meters down I just watched the vlogs back of where I was before and I went through a fence and I lost the the, the tent. Oh my I have to run back. I'm gonna leave my back here It's meant to be a rainstorm coming as you can see the rain is already coming it's gonna hit me soon and I have to run back for the tent because it's an expensive tent and I need to set up a tent here to go further up the Munro for this 48 hour Munro walk or hill walk, mountain walks. But wow, look at the scenery. I can't believe I have to go down. I really have to go now. I literally have to go highways back into the ferns. Look how high they are. I have to go through all this to get to the path I wanted to go to. But uh, yeah, I found the place where I lost the tent. It's over there. It's like a muddy, muddy bit. I almost abandoned mission. No, I don't abandon missions. I was almost gonna sleep without a tent, just in the sleeping bag and just embrace it, like. But I didn't do it, managed to find it by watching the vlogs back. At least I found it. So uh, up we go to set up the tent. I find that I'm always having to make amends for shortcomings. Set up the tent, time to sleep, and wake up for sunrise. Another day in sunny Scotland. It looks absolutely beautiful. This morning was no sunrise, just low cloud which looked absolutely fantastic. I probably should have taken a panorama, but again, I'm not here to take any other photos than the one I got in my mind. When it's harder to learn than to teach, soldier on. I do believe that it's someone Reached my first summit, the first Munro. Wow, what a spectacular view. Look at that, all across Scotland, the Highlands. Oh, beautiful. Ben Nevers in the background, Nevers Range, mountains everywhere, 360 panorama. Absolutely spectacular, wow. So yeah, I'm gonna set up the tent here. It's gonna be further, just a tiny bit down now because I want to get a panorama view here either at sunset or sunrise sunrise the matter the sun is gonna go behind the mountains knee towards the Nevers range and Renwick Moor in between the two uh, it should come up there and then I want to go a tiny bit below the mountain and then capture a, a panorama eight images and I see some stacks down there, which looks absolutely spectacular. So I'm gonna to try to frame the stacks inside the photo and then I see if I can get a, a, or create a panorama. The only thing that's missing now 
is either golden hour or a spectacular sunset or I think it looks better in sunrise this location because the sun is coming from that direction uh, which I want to shoot towards yeah, the 360 view is just amazing what a hike hoping for that light to hit the top of the peaks up in front of me and it's actually starting to it's actually starting to pick up some of the peaks over there but that's not where I wanted the light I wanted to, the light to be on my peak in front of me lighting it up but uh wow what a beautiful place that's so beautiful see so yeah, I'm gonna try to create like an eight image panorama of this area because it looks beautiful I wanted to go further down the stacks but it's too dangerous, like I already slipped down the mountain. <laughs> Whoops. But um, yeah, I'm gonna create an eight, eight image panorama. I'm gonna shoot this at F11 so everything is sharp because I do have a bit of foreground here. Normally I wouldn't include a foreground. But yeah, the light is starting to come now. Yes. We just need that soft light to hit that mountain in front of me. We're reaching golden hour now. And the patient has held on. There's a rainbow literally above. Oh, wow. Literally above where I wanted to shoot. That's amazing. Wow. There was just a rain coming towards me and it's still raining at the moment, but the light is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm actually so excited because there's a rainbow. Look how beautiful. Wow, I'm just capturing this quickly because it's gonna go fade quickly. Wow, it's gonna, well, I can't even speak. That's, I, I was almost about to abandon this place because there's no light, no light or whatever. But uh, wow, 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 wow. Scotland does it again. Rainbows, patience, and everything works out in the end. Wow. Absolutely spectacular. Just getting a few. So I'm making a panorama, nine images across this whole area. And then the rainbow just perfectly, bam, I'll show you. The light of the cloud casted a light, reflected a light back to the mountain and created this beautiful rainbow. Wow, <laughs> that looks, I don't know how the panel's gonna look out or turn out, but wow, that was absolutely amazing. That was an incredible feeling. What a day, everything, rain, sun, rain, heavy winds. I'm gonna go to bed now and uh, I'm gonna get caught in the rain tomorrow morning so I'm on this bridge which shouldn't I should have moved further down to get out of the wind but I can see the low clouds rolling over the hills now and I'm gonna get caught in tomorrow but we'll see uh, so yeah I'm gonna go back in good night <laughs>